Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. So it's been, I think, um, a little while since I made a video, about a week or so. Um, I had wanted to make one sooner than this, but I had a bit of a cold again last week, unfortunately. Oh well. Um, it wasn't too bad, I just couldn't talk very well. Um, my voice was quite raspy, I guess. Um, and I actually ended up taking a few days off of work uh, because of it. Yeah, um, it's the way it goes, I guess, when you when you talk so much for a job, you need a voice, and if you don't have a voice, it's not good for work. <laughs> uh, yeah, so anyways, uh, but yeah, I'm mostly better now, I guess. Um, it took a while, though. It took a little while. Actually, I think when I made my last video, I still wasn't feeling all that well. It was, when did I make that video? Last Thursday. Wednesday? Thursday? I don't remember now. <laughs> I'd have to check. Um, but yeah, around that time I wasn't feeling that well and I think I was just pushing myself too hard and yeah, I ended up losing my voice a bit. So, oh well, that's the way it goes. But yeah, anyway, so it's been, uh, it's been quite a day. Quite a day. Um, so, last night I had a dream that I was going to be late for work. So, not that many of you probably know this area very well at all, but of course there's a couple train stations near where I work. There's like a subway station and two other different kinds of train stations. It's like a little hub area. Um, but I usually don't go to work by train, I go by bicycle. Um, but yeah, so it was in my dream though. So, but for some reason in my dream, I was on my way to work and I got on the train and I'm like, okay, how many stops until the stop I need to get off of? And they're like, like five or something, like five, but I have to work soon. They're like, sorry. <laughs> I'm like, uh, okay. But in reality, it wouldn't be like that at all. Even from my house to the station I need to go to is only three. Yeah, it's only three stations away, so I don't know what my brain was doing last night. But anyway, so I guess you can know where you can tell where this story is going. So, anyways, I started work late today, um, at 5 p.m. Short day today. So I was thinking about going to work. No, I was thinking about making this video earlier in the day because it was a really nice day today. It's quite sunny. So I thought, okay, I'll go to a park, maybe make a video do stuff like that but then I got on voice chat with somebody ended up talking for a while and I didn't get outside quick enough or early enough so I had to go to work so when I got outside around four o'clock the clouds were looking dark I'm like uh oh that's not good so I'm like well let's just go <laughs> so got on my bike and started going I'm like oh no I have to go to the ATM I need money to pay my bills, which I didn't pay today. Got to do that tomorrow, I guess. Um, so I headed towards the bank. Well, the, the post office, the post office is a bank. Yeah. So anyways, headed to the post office to use the ATM there. Got my money out, left. And then I was going down the road and I have a road bike. So I go on the road and like in Japan, or at least in this city, you're supposed to ride on the road anyways there's like a bicycle lane um yeah a lane like yeah you can visualize it from that i guess <laughs> um so anyways i'm going down the road and it's starting to get more and more dark the clouds are getting darker I'm like uh oh that's not good so i got about halfway to work almost halfway and it started sprinkling i'm like oh, okay well let's see if we can just out run it because on the other side of the cloud it's bright and sunny and that's like the direction I'm going let's just see if we can outrun this storm let's go and I don't know what happened if I hit a bump or something but I ran over something I don't know and it just it was like a thump a loud thump and I'm like oh that's not good that's not good for my bike and then I noticed, okay, now it's starting to make funny noises. So I stopped 
and checked my tire and uh-oh, the air's going down, uh-oh. But oh, maybe it's just low anyways, because for whatever reason. Um, so then I just got on, kept going, and then it started pouring down rain. Not pouring, but it, it got really heavy. But thankfully, I always carry a poncho in my bag, which, speaking of which, I need to take out of my bag right now because it might still be a little wet. <laughs> um, now that I think about it. Oh no, it's dry enough. But we'll just let it dry out a little bit. Toss on a chair behind me. But anyways, um, pulled out the poncho, put that on, and then as I put on the poncho, I started going down the road a bit more, and I noticed that my backpack was open. Thankfully, I had a poncho on, so it was covering, and it just fell off the chair. <laughs> so it was covering what was inside my backpack, but yeah, my zipper can get loose sometimes. It's an old backpack, so um, the zipper got loose. It was peeling open. I'm like, oh, geez, oh, come on. So I jumped off the bike, ripped off the poncho, hurry up and zipped up the backpack, make, made sure that nothing fell out, like my iPad or notebook or whatever, and my bill that I still need to pay. Zipped it back up, threw it back on, threw the poncho back on, got on a bike and started to ride and noticed my tire was completely flat. Completely 100% flat, like zero air in it at all. And I'm like, oh no. And I'm like, I'm, I'm still like, I have to go over a river, I have to go over the train tracks, I have to go through the station area, station, yeah, station area, and then get to the, where I work. I'm still like, I bicycle, it's only like five minutes. Um, but my tire's now flat. <laughs> oh no. So you shouldn't ride on a flat tire, but I pushed up the hill and just kind of stood up on it. I didn't put a lot of weight down on the bike and just kind of coasted down to the train tracks, uh, just to get there quicker as I crossed over the river. And here comes a train. <laughs> so the gates go down. Now I have to wait. I'm looking to clock. I'm like, oh boy, 4.48. I start at 5. This isn't good. So I crossed the road, pushed the bike up the hill, got on it again. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> you shouldn't ride a bike on a flat tire, but I did it anyways because it was only going to be for like 30 seconds. Got down the road as quick as I could. Made it to a parking garage, parked my bike, ran to my school, and made it with like two or three minutes to spare. I wasn't late. My dream didn't come true. <laughs> That's a good dream to not come true. But yeah, I wasn't late. Um, I made it. Uh, but yeah, I was covered in rain. Rain? Covered in rain? I was wet from the rain. I was sweating. It wasn't... A good first lesson. Oh, the lesson was fine, but I mean, it was fine. It was no problem at all, but I was just hot and sweaty and oh well. But at least it's cooling down outside, so it wasn't too bad. If it had been like summertime this happened, that would have been real bad. I mean, today it was like, what's the temperature now? 60? Yeah, it was like 60 or so today, so not too bad. Um, so it was a cool run, <laughs> um, but I made it on time, but yeah. Talk about a day. My flat tire on a new tires I just bought. Um, and I when I've replaced the tires, I can't remember if I talked about it in my last video or not. Oh wait, I think I Yeah, I talked about my tires going bad and then the next day I bought new tires. Yeah, that would have been Thursday, Friday I got the tires, I think. Yeah. I think so. But anyways, got new tires and I, when I was replacing the tires, I wasn't paying attention. I guess I accidentally punctured the front tire and now the back tire is flat, punctured. So that's what I get for buying new tires. <laughs> oh well, it happens. <clears throat> and I've put like, I don't know how many kilometers or miles on it, like hundreds already in less than a year. So probably needed to be changed anyways. I don't know. So anyways, that was the, not the start of my day, but it was like the start of my work shift. So, but I made it, no problem. But then, sorry, drinking some cinnamon tea. But then, 
I couldn't ride my bike home, so I had to push my bike all the way home, and it's like five kilometers almost, I think, so it was at like two and a half miles, um, something like that, three miles, I don't know, um, in the end, but it took, usually it would take like 15, 20 minutes to ride home, took an hour and a half to walk home, but of course I was going really slow, I was listening to a podcast, and I went to the supermarket, so yeah, it was fine, I didn't mind, it was a nice walk, anyways, it's not that cold, nice temperature, and the rain stopped, so yeah, that's my exciting story for today, <laughs> um, but yeah, and then what else, not much going on, just busy, 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 <clears throat> excuse me, I'm working on some projects for my class that I have about a month and a half to finish them, but I'm trying to get them worked on as much as possible, as soon as possible, so that I don't have to panic at the last minute to try to get them both done. Um, I don't know how many pages I have to write. Um, it's like 4,000 words or something, so that's like 10 pages or something. I don't know. Uh, but so two 10-page projects that I have to work on by beginning of December. I can do it. No problem. But yeah, that's that. Um, not much else going on. Just studying <clears throat> work. Uh, I'm debating about buying a new camera lens. Um, I have a new lens in mind. I think I've talked about it before and I keep going back and forth if I want to buy it. But I need to go out and take some pictures soon. Um, fortunately, I'm kind of busy next week as well. But yeah, it's going to be fall season. Well, I guess it is fall now, but the leaves will be changing soon. So I'm going to get out and get some pictures of that this year. Maybe go somewhere if I have a chance. I moved to Kyoto a little bit last year. No, not for a fall. For summer I did. Maybe for fall I can go to Kyoto this year. I don't know. We'll see what how much time I have. How busy I am. It'd be nice to go up to um, Mino Waterfall again. Um, I posted some pictures of that last year. Um, that's where all the monkeys are. So that'd be fun to see again. Uh, now that I have like the zoom lens as well. And if I get that new lens I want, that'd be fun to take some monkey photos again with that lens. But we'll see um, what happens in the next couple of weeks. going to be pretty busy, I guess. So, but other than that, I don't, I don't know what else to talk about. It. There's not much going on. Um, just study, 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 work, 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 work. Um, yeah, I guess the one project I am working on is, uh, I guess it's, it's, <clears throat> I'm trying to relate it to my hobbies, basically, so it's kind of fun for me to work on, uh, it's about, I have to design a reading course, so, yeah, it should be fun, I'm trying to base it around my hobbies, I don't want to talk about too much, because I don't know, um, how, well, I don't know if I'll be able to go through with the project completely. Well, I don't know. We'll see. But I was telling one of my classmates about it, and she's like, that's a million-dollar idea. Let's become partners. <laughs> so it could be. Maybe. I don't know. See what happens. It could be a good idea. So that's why I'm um, not going to talk about it too much. <laughs> uh, no. But, yeah, we'll see what happens. But, yeah, I don't, I don't know what else to talk about. Um, I've been playing Zelda. Yeah, that's about it. So, I don't know. I think we'll just stop there for now. If something exciting happens soon, I'll make another video. Or if I just want to rant or ramble, I'll make another video soon. Hopefully soon, though. Um, the next video, I want to get outside and make it somewhere outside in a nice weather somewhere. So maybe I'll... Well, my plan was to go to Osaka Castle today before work, but that didn't happen, so... Which is good because I would have probably been caught in a rain making a video and that would have been bad. So, I don't know. We'll see. I'm going to drink more of my cinnamon tea. And probably go to bed soon. Maybe play a little bit of Zelda before bed. Because I have to work in the morning. So anyways, I'm done rambling. So anyways, thanks for watching. I will uh, catch you guys next time. Peace.